Crazy, right? This entire sculpture came from just one click in Swap AI, and now it even handles PBR materials, so the detail look insanely real. Hi there, this is Nicer, I drop exciting videos here every week, and in this one, I'm gonna walk you through the brand new AI features in Swap AI. They are honestly mind-blowing, so make sure to stick around till the end. Before we start, don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends. Now let's jump in. So first of all, if you haven't updated the Swap AI yet, do it right now. A new feature has been added to Swap AI previously. Its options were separate in the extension toolbar, but now all of them are combined and accessible under Swap AI. You no longer have to deal with Swap I and Swap Air separate. Everything is gathered in one plugin and easier to use than ever. So as you know, today Jazz will work with Swap I. Click on it. After click on it, you will see this window. I think you know how to use Swap I'm since I have already made a video about it. If you haven't watched it yet, check it out on our YouTube channel. So today I'll just show you the new features of Swap I'm. First, let me upload a picture. For example, this one. Click on open. So, as you know, here is accuracy of our model. Increase that. Here, write a name for our model. For example, ST01. And write a description here. A new feature is here. When you came here on create button, you will see this window. As you see, there is three different modes, fast, find, and part. I will tell you about all of them, right? Now let me tell you just about fast mode. What is the fast mode? If you just want a quick preview or to test something, this mode is perfect. The quality is lower, but the speed is amazing. So let's try this picture on the fast mode, right? Click on create. Later we will compare it with other modes to see the difference. So as you see it's done. Now let's import it. Let me put it here. As you see this is the fast mode. Now let's try the other modes. For example, fine mode. Here we have two options. Make sure to active the texture and PBR option. Then make sure to increase the accuracy too. Now let's click on create. So what is the fine mode? The fine mode gives better quality and more details. It's still pretty fast, but ideal when you want to descend detailed output. As you see, it's ready and a new feature is here. When you use fine mode, you will see this window. From here, you can edit the texture of your model, for example, rotation of the texture, scale, and something else. I right here you can do it. And if you don't want to change the settings, you can reset that too. And also here, texture, select material. We can choose another material for our model. Click here, then you will see this window. As you see, there is different groups of material. You can choose one of them for your model. For example, let me try a stone. 
for example, here. Let me try this Istrun for our model, this one. As you see, it's ready. Wow, it's so amazing. Now it has a stone material. Let's change it. Another one. For example, rock stone. Now it has a rock stone material without any reflection and the other one for example this one this marvel and if you want to keep the original material just click on reset here and another feature of the swap I'm is here this toolbar there is different option for example different model and different view for example front back left right different view and also this option allows you to have auto rotation let me use it click on it so the next option is material gallery here i told you about it we can use it from here and also here and this window select material so now if you want to have the reflection of the material choose pbr model then import that and also a new feature on import button when you come here you will see this window simplify if you want your model to stay smooth keep it at zero percent and if you want fewer segments push it to hundred percent you can play around with it but I recommend keep it at 0% because it makes the model looks smoother and nicer. So now let's import that. Wow, this is so different between the fast mode and fine mode fine mode is so cool wow it's so amazing wow it's incredible i love it look at the reflection on the statue it's so great it's so cool i love it so now let's try part mode what is the part mode we didn't have before previously when you convert a model to 3d everything was one piece so you couldn't assign material separately to parts now it's split every section into separate groups and you can easily apply any material to each group you have full control over every part so let's try that it's better to try this mode on a different picture for example this chair let me open that and increase the accuracy and click on create so as you can see they group it every part separately by its material it's so cool it's so amazing now we can use custom material on it for example let's go to select material and find carpet let me change the scale
and also here too. So, and also a wood material base. Select that. Find wood material. As you can see, Swap AI has powerful material gallery. You can find different material right here. Let's use this texture. I think it's good. Let's try another one. And also for this one too. Wow, it's so cool. It's so amazing. I recommend you use it right now. I hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you. For more tutorials, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. And don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends. See you next time.